Don't place a trade based on what you'll see in this video because there is no guarantees of making a profit in the market. It takes you a long time to become a good trader. So this video here is just to educate you to become a much better trader. So in this video, I am going to be talking about the death of the leveraged ETFs. I think the ETFs guys are going to absolutely just blow up in people's faces. And I know Michael Burry, he actually talked about this as well too when it comes to um, the death of the leverage ETFs. And this is a big, 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 big mistake. So that's what I wanna cover with today, guys. Um, and I know Michael Burry once again, and he talked about like there's a, the, the ETFs are in a big, massive bubble. And I wanna talk about what I think about it and what I'm seeing right now, physically in the markets right now. All right, guys, let's actually get straight into it. The thing is this, is that I see so many people, like they may look at the, like you can look at the SPY, right? So this is the SPY right now. Let me just take everything off the screen. This is the S&P 500, right? Let me bring up, say, the last six months. And you can see nice big dip, nice little rally, and we had a little update today, okay? Not much going on. Um, and we can sit there, right? But then we have this, like, XPXL, and there's a, there's a differences here, right? Like, look at this here, right? So this is supposed to be, this here is supposed to be the three times, three times the leverage of the S&P 500, right? That's the, that's the bull um, three time leverage there. Anyway, if I look at the S&P 500, right, the SPY itself, this is just the SPY, standard SPY. If I bring up a Fibonacci level from the high, point A, down to point B, so all I did is I just grabbed the Fibonacci and I pointed it from the high point to the ultimate low point. And look at this here, we are ultimately breaking now above the 62% level and we are breaking up, right? So it's showing a bit of strength in the bull market here. Um, in the in in this whole thing here, is it going to run up? It's going to I don't know. Okay, <laughs> but what I want to talk about here is this: is the death of the leverage ETFs. I think the main ETFs, the SPY, uh, the DJI, the QQQ, those sort of main ETFs, or especially the SPY. Right? The SPY, I think, is is one of the largest ones out there. Um, if you're looking for a sort of a, a safer ETF to go into. Um, that's not going to blow up. The SPY is that, right? So we have that there. Look at this here. It's above, a way above, well above the 62% level. But if I go to the three times leverage, which should be different, right? Which should be a lot more than just a retracement like here. If I go to the SPXL, look at this here. I'm going to draw a Fibonacci from the ultimate high down to ultimate low. And we are just right now at where? Where? Right there. We're at the 38% level, where the actual, the normal SPY, right, the normal S&P is what? It's well up here somewhere. But hang on a minute, this XPXL is supposed to be three times leverage. Something is not right here, right? This is supposed to be the three times leverage. So this is the death of the leveraged ETFs here. Um, you know, the biggest ticking time bomb of our century of 2020, right? This is the, the this is the biggest ticking time bomb of our century. We go to things like the GDX, right? Look at this here. So we go to the GDX here. Look at the GDX breaking up to all time new highs. We dipped in March, then broke up where we are right now. Nice little pullback. We're probably likely to continue that pullback. Um, and oh, by the way, guys, if, for people on my YouTube videos in the past, you know, they, they're like, you know, don't listen to this guy, he's speculation, blah, blah, blah. I'm telling you right now, guys, don't listen to those morons who keep telling you, just buy anyway, it's okay, it's going to keep going up. No, don't just buy whenever, right? Don't listen to those morons, right? What you want to do is wait for a good pullback and then wait, wait, wait for a good buying opportunity, okay? Don't just buy when the market's been going up. Anyway. So this is, look at this here, right? This is the GDX, this is the GDX, right? Which is a major large ETF of the gold miners index, right? And this GDXJ is the is obviously the, the junior index. But if I go to things like the the JNUG, right? So the JNUG is what? It's the gold juniors miners two times, right? So this is supposed to be two times leverage, which means you're supposed to get two times the movement out of that. But look at this here, if I go to the GDXJ, right? Here's the GDXJ. Where is the GDXJ? Not only did the GDXJ bounce in the middle of March, but it's now at all time new, or it's at all time new highs for the year. If I go to the JNUG, right? Yes, we got the, yes, we got the crash with everyone else, but we're still at all time lows. The JNUG should be up here somewhere. What's going on? This 
is the death. The biggest ticking time bomb of our century is here right now. And if anyone is in these massive leverage ETFs, they're gonna completely go belly up big time. The safer ones are the GDX, GDXJ, the SIL, not the leverage. Do not be getting involved with these legendary ETFs. It's physically apparent, 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 apparent. <laughs> it's physically apparent what's going on right now, okay? You can clearly see that there's a decoupling and the, and, and the ones that are supposed to be three times and two times, which are supposed to make bigger moves, are nowhere near it, right? This is the death, and this is the death of, um, this is the death of the leveraged ETFs. Um, and if you guys are involved in any of these leveraged ETFs here, guys, my recommendation is just to get out of them whenever you can, because these these can just simply just go belly up and go bankrupt, and you lose all your money. Now, I'm not going to tell you exactly what to do because I can't tell you that. You do do what you think, but I'm trying to provide you evidence of why I don't, I I don't, and I've been telling my private clients, um. To not to not to get into this here. I want to trade the GDX. I want to trade the GDXJ. I want to trade the GLD. I want to trade the G SLV, the SPY. They're the main big ones, right? That are, that are not leveraged. The death of the leveraged ETFs is the biggest ticking time bomb of our century. Hey traders, John Hal here. Thanks for watching my video. For a limited time only, I am giving away free access to my brand new trading course. I've put all my most powerful systems, strategies, and trading techniques that I've learned over the last 15 years and put it in this course and I'm giving away for free for a limited time. See, in this brand new God the Markets by the Boys trading course, and you can get it when you go to johnsfreegift.com, you're gonna learn, first you're gonna get access to a brand new training course for 90 minutes and you're gonna learn all the details step by step to my number one trading system with over a 90% success rate that works on any market and any time frame. You're also gonna learn three powerful chart reading and trading techniques. You're also gonna learn at two more powerful trading systems and also you're gonna learn seven figure trading secrets, mindset techniques, and so much more. There's top 13 mistakes you're gonna learn, the 10K per month formula, and so much more. No, this is not a get rich quick scheme, but if you are struggling with your trading right now and you need help, then for a limited time, you can get free access to this. So. Go to johnsfreegift.com right now or click on the very first thing in the description because for a limited time, I've given away. So go to johnsfreegift.com right now and start getting access to this full complete trading course plus also the free trading with my number one trading system with over 90% success rate. Go to that right now and I'll see you on the next page.